Oh, there's fire over here. Definitely getting that. The gate of the vanquished. We've made it. All right, don't you go killing each other. Yeah. Alright, you two, let's break it up now before someone starts a freaking civil war. You're here. And I thought you didn't care. Aloy, did you come to witness the challenge? Does there have to be a challenge? Oh, yeah, there does. If you persist, all of these squads will join the fights. How many will die here? And how many will die in our villages once the retaliation begins? There has to be another way. Please. Listen to what she has to say. You both owe her that much. I'm not choosing a side. Yara, do you really need to do this? He sabotaged the wound. You can't tell me you believe he knew nothing about it. And it was all part of his plan to force a confrontation. Don't you see? This is what he's wanted all along. It doesn't matter how many die as long as he gets what he wants. Command of the clan. No. I'm putting an end to this. Now! Draka, you lost a lot of good people hunting machine hearts to trade for water. You want to lose more now? But that cost is exactly why I'm doing this. Why I had to send people to find other sources in the first place. I swear to you, I had nothing to do with what happened to the wound. I believe you. Ukta came to me, said he found underground leaks. I know. Might lead to another well, that's all. I didn't tell him to screw it all up and drain the wound. So stand down so we can all talk about this. No. No more talking, no more lies. <sighs> I can't be trusted. That's been proved. I don't want to pick a side. Ugh. Is this how you two plan to save your clan? By causing a massacre over who gives the orders? Drop this foolishness and work together. She's right. Put away your spears. Return to your homes. Which means she stays in charge? Forget it. You see? Replacing me is all he cares about. It's a vendetta. And it has to end here. I refuse. Once we agree. No. Pick a side, Aloy. Because we're settling this now. No. There must be a way to minimize the bloodshed. No. Tanakh never make things easy, do they? No. I'm afraid not. Ugh. What? I don't want to. He didn't. <laughs> she didn't. I don't know. Like. <sighs> I want to say, like, Draka didn't do it on purpose, but at the same time, he's choosing to put her off of being chief just because he disagrees with one choice she made. And yes, she lied about the water. Which isn't great, but... Becoming commander isn't going to change what happened to the wound, Draka. If you really wanted to help your people, you would be throwing away more lives just to change who gives the orders. You really are something, Flame of the Desert. But I didn't come all this way to let things stay the way they are. They're not they supposed to us. Just us. You want to save lives? Keep your squads out of it. <sighs> I've seen how you fight. These soldiers are with me. Then we stand with Aloy and Yara. Even numbers. <sighs> Fine, old man. It's your funeral. Ugh. New rules. We're keeping it to just us. Winner takes command. Is this not going to still cause people to be upset? Nice knowing you, Aloy. I don't like this. They know I'm here. You should have backed down when you had the chance. Oh, hello. Who the f I thought you were on my side. Why would they start me with someone who's not on my side? Okay, so you, you weld lightning. Uh, you're weak to ice. Okay. 
Do I have ice equipped? No, I got a lot of electricity. Uh. Okay, one second. Second, I'm coming. Are they I don't even know which one's Draka. That's Yara. That's the old man. Jataka. Draka. Oh, did it say if he was weak to anything? He's not. But hey, you just had an explosive barrel. Craft it! Craft it! Thank you! You freaking dingus! Go! Keep it simple! Okay, 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 okay. Is this how it's gonna be? Told you. Oh, that wasn't Draka. I thought it was. Come here, follow me to the explosive barrels. Damn it. Is he dead? Is he dead? I'm sorry, Doctor. <laughs> Not just yet. You did your best to follow the path. You die with honor. What? <sighs> All right. I didn't like how that happened. I didn't like it at all. Did it have to end like that? It's the way of the desert. <sighs> well, what happens now? We live off the water the wound ekes out, rationing until it fills back up. And I'll make sure Arrowhand gets its fair share. Yeah, okay. you'd better. The desert never forgets. And I won't either. You better not. Without this kind of sucked. I mean. I give this to you now. For all you've done for this clan. What is it? I hate when I can't see it. I got a uh, Firestorm Warrior Bow. Nice. Going down. Yo, Silga. What's up? Aloy, the words stopped coming from the spike. What happened? This is what was speaking to your rig. It's old world equipment used for communicating over long distances. The message must have shut off when I took it, but. I heard the note the voice was talking about. What was it? During an ancient war, a woman was trying to deliver supplies to a man she knew. She wanted him to know that their past disagreements didn't matter in the big picture. That she'd be thinking of him when the end came. Oh. 
I guess she and I are kin of a sort. Yeah. I wish I could give my brother a message like that. Tell him that I forgave him. I think he knows. He would have wanted that. I know. This man, the, the old one, did he ever hear the message? I don't think so. I guess that's often the way of it then. But still, with the power of that device you found, the sender had hope that he might have heard it. What a feat. To send messages near and far. Can I keep this? Of course. It's a treasure. If I wanted to keep it myself, I wouldn't have brought it to you. Thank you. You're welcome. Sometimes people don't ever get to hear what they should. I know. But with this thing, maybe I can get them talking to one another. I like that. From Mainspring, all the way to who knows where. Anywhere. I, uh, I found a few more things in the supply cache. Might be able to make something out of them. Can I use your workbench? Sure. Yeah, right over there. Anytime, Aloy. It's all yours. Thanks. I think I know just what to do with these parts. What? What? A splintwood spike thrower created from old world, world world technology. This weapon launches drill spikes, which cause damage over time and excel tearing off armor and machine parts. Huh. Rebels. That's a knock soldier warned me about them. Whatever they're doing, it can't be good. That's someone. Oh, a prisoner. Okay. Is it just the one right now? Are they all gonna come attack me at once when I get just one? That should have killed you. That should have killed you. I've been spotted. Yeah, it should have killed them. There. Find whoever's in charge. Figure out what's going on in this camp. Oh, I was trying to get the prisoner out. What is that? Looks like they're getting ready to ship out these weapons and armor. Probably to rebels all over the west. Better hurt their operations if I get rid of them. Oh, that's a lot. Okay. I got this. I got this. Just get a bunch of stealth shots. Not see him. Oh, I missed. Damn it, that time they saw me. Keep it that way. Where did that come from? You? You're with okay. Me. We'll track her down. Lights and the hostile. We've 
Got it to knock the prisoner. Where's the prisoner? There. The champion killer. Are you here to wipe out these traitors? I'm here to help. So just follow my lead. Easy enough. Why isn't it blowing up? There we go. Keep your eyes and blades sharp. Oh, I didn't have you marked. There's so many of you. Oh, wait, is that the tax? Okay. Why can't I do the strike from above? What is wrong with you? That's what I meant to do. Should be. Oh, I should not be close to that. I need more ammo. Okay. Clothes on her. There are clothes on me. Move, move, thank you. Move, 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 thank you. Who else is left? Is my guy still alive? Oh god. Did I get him killed? They're just making me angry. No, I don't think he was the guy that was with me. Think this is a game, Outlander? Just you wait. Can I search over there? No, 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 should you? Where's the guy I freed? I'll try over there. I have her. That is Fuck off. No. Thank you. You were supposed to die the first time. Like that. See, that guy knew what was up. No, 
how many are you? Holy crap. I fortified an entire section of the camp. I don't know. Can I figure it out? Don't lose your edge. It might not be over. It's only a matter of time. How do I get down more? Everyone on high alert. We got a dead body. Could be a trap. Oh, what's this? I wonder where this leads. Let me see. Shifting. Oh, Intruder. fuck you. Bring in that covering. Punch her down. Firing again. No. Yeah. Guys are friendly. Time to see what these are up to. Where have you gone now? Oh, is this where the leader is finally? Oh shit. Sons of Prometheus operative. Okay. Ah, is that the leader? The champion. I'm so sorry. Yes. Why? I don't know. I should take a look in there. Might be a command center. Okay. Command center. Looks like they have some kind of forge. A forge for what? Oh, I got a piercing sharp shot bow. What's this? To all sons of Prometheus engineers and operatives. I've been hearing some belly aching. Whining about the Tanakh, the work, the conditions, the occasional limb loss to a machine when someone gets careless. I get it. It's been a long road. We've suffered. We'll continue to suffer. But we're close. This alliance will get us what we want, I promise. The Karja will pay for the Red Raids, in blood. And so will all their collaborators in the Vanguard at Back in the Claim. So shut up, get back to work, and always remember, a reckoning is on the way. It sounds like the sons of Prometheus want blood. And the Karja are the target. Sure does. Let's see what else these guys have been up to. Let's. Hmm. Do I want to look at the weapons? No? Can I inspect it at all? No? Should I blow it up? I feel like I should blow it up. Yeah, okay. Instead of bringing it for people that could use it, we're just going to destroy it. That works. Oopsie, wrong button. How do I get underneath? Now let's go see what they were up to at that command center. I thought that I just checked the command center. Was that not it?
Is that just more weapons and armor? Rebels have been busy making weapons and armor. Mm hmm. They'll be sending out much equipment now. Rebels will have to resupply elsewhere. Mm-hmm. What the? Killed her. I was supposed to critical strike her. Come on. anyone left? No, they all died. Oh. Looks like Kalai and the search party took down a few machines when they were here. There's the broken bridge. I'm gonna have to take care of these machines before I can look around. Mm-hmm. What's it with you? It's weak to ice. Ah. That's purge water. I'm sure this will still hurt. There's more. Oh! Where are you now? Oh, shit. A new plan. Okay. Now to look for Kalai's seat pouch. I better start at the bridge. 
A lot of footprints. Must be from the search party. Bree said this is where they found his wife's instrument. The search party concluded Kalai's body was probably carried away by the river. But from up there, that old tree would have caught her. I don't think she actually fell. I should check up at the promontory. Okay. Maybe the search party missed something. Is she not dead? It looks like the search party took the trail under the stone arch. That must be the way up to the promontory. Dead end. Not getting up to the promontory that way. I should see where the other trail leads, back by the broken bridge. Practically indestructible. Debris. There must have been another path up. Guess Kalai and the search party climbed the cliff instead. This broke off some time ago. Why do I get the feeling this isn't going to be an easy thing to pull off? An old Utaru trailhead. Looks like this is where the Rite of Discovery started. Is there anything around here? Debris on the trail. Oh, it looks like pieces of a bridge. Hmm. Looks like this fell down here a long time ago. Maybe from a storm. Ah, this way. Okay. That's the bridge. Just, just, just do the. Okay, never mind. The I pressed the button. Away. Kalai must have climbed her way up too. If Kalai made it to the top, she must have been a good climber. It doesn't add up that she fell. It doesn't, but she might have dropped something. Maybe she's alive. Ooh, do not jump in that way. This way is where we're going. Hello. This must be the promontory. Looks like Kalai was doing something at that stone table. I should take a look. I was playing some flowers, ground into a dye. Kalai must have done this as part of her ritual. I should look around. My focus will help me figure out what happened to her. These flowers have a trace of something on their petals. The dye Kalai was wearing. Looks like it left a trail. Okay. Too faint for the search party to have noticed, but my focus can pick it up. Well, okay. Well, I want to see what's in here, even if I'm not going this way. This was part of the Bride of Discovery. All of the marks look old. Kalai must not have gotten to this part. There's the dye trail. Looks like it leads away from the cliff edge. Okay. Ah, there it is. Thank you. Die trail ends here. With a lot of broken branches. I should take a closer look. were snapped off recently from some kind of struggle and over here drag marks looks like they lead through this thicket I can follow them with my focus what happened to her to 
two bodies? One must be Kalai, but who's the other woman? Oh. Kalai. Those marks on her neck. She was strangled. That's horrible. At least I can return her seat pouch to Bree. What about the other one? So the killer must have tried to push Kalai off the cliff. That's why the search party found her instrument by the river. But Kalai fought back. So the killer strangled her. And then dragged her here. Of course, there's a machine. Wait, wait. I'm not ready. What are you weak to? Electricity. I got lots of electricity. Give me a second. Please stop. I hear it, but I don't I'll give up the hunt soon enough. See it. <gasps> oh, never mind. I didn't even see me get hit. That's not fair. How could I dodge if I didn't even see myself get hit? Where'd it go? Where's the friend? It's just another stalker. Alright. I hate these things. Gotcha. Okay. I better grab the killer's seat pouch. Might help identify her. Oh, so the one sitting beside her is the killer? I thought maybe... Well, I mean, I don't know who else it would have been, but why did they want to kill her? Maybe Fane and Carol back in Plainsong will know who the seat pouch belongs to. I can go ask. Another rumor. One second. Give me my rumor. Give me my rumor. I hear Tanakh's rebels have taken over the border gates west of here. Best stay clear of them if you're heading that way. Thanks for the heads up. More rebels. 
and the Utaru have enough to deal with. Maybe they could use a little help. We all lament Kalei's death. That's Kalei's. You found it. Bree. Kalei didn't fall. She was murdered. What? I went up to the promontory. I found Kalai and the body of the woman who killed her. That's impossible. The search party already checked up there. There was nothing. The bodies were in a separate clearing. Away from where the search party checked. A stalker had mauled her while she was trying to hide Kalai's body. Who was she? I was hoping you would know. I brought back her seed pouch. That belongs to Lina. Kel's apprentice. I don't understand. Why would she do this? Maybe we should ask Kel. But she... You, there. Where is Kel? I saw her leave out the East Gate about an hour ago. She's going home. Summer wind. She's running away? She needs to stand trial. I can catch her. Where is this place? Look for a ruined settlement at our southern border. It's her childhood home. We will get the guards. I'm a getter. To catch up with you. I'm a getter. You're welcome. I'm a getter. She won't get away with this. I will. You're back. I'm leaving. That must be summer wind. But where is Kel? I don't know. Let's figure it out. Uh, how do I get up there? <laughs> oh, what's this? Nothing. Uh, is there a grapple? Okay, but how do I get up there? <laughs> I'm stuck. Oh, stairs. Perfect. Cal, I'm coming for you. What's up? So now everyone knows. It's only a matter of time once you went up that cliff. Then why would you make it so obvious? Whose wife you had murdered and told him to move on. I never wanted any of this to happen. Then why? Kalei sowed the seeds of discord. What? She wanted the Utaru to leave Plainsong. Abandon our home. Your eyes don't that look great. Caught on. It would have been more destructive than any sickness or machine. So you had her killed? That's so bad. The natural order to all things. No. Growth. Decay. Decay and murder are different. It's the way of the world. The tree cannot pick up its roots. So okay, but you're not trees. What was threatening us. I'm sorry it came to it. You don't I'm seem sorry. sorry. I'm gonna make sure you pay for all the suffering you've caused. Too late. She's dying. That's why her eyes are black. Two people dead. At least you're paying with your life. My choice. All of this was your choice. No. She needed to stand trial. I didn't kill her. Justice. I didn't kill her. She's dead, Bree. That's justice enough. It isn't much, but I want you to have this as thanks. Okay. I won't have to spend the rest of my days wondering what happened to Kalai. That's fair. Blighted are the leaves. Three of our people dead. And for what? Nothing, really. I admit it. I never wanted you among us. But now, it seems I must thank you. 
You're welcome. Revealing the rot that had taken hold here. I'm sorry it had to happen this way. Yeah. At least with the rot removed. New growth can thrive. Right. Okay. They both have things to say. I'll plant Kali's seed pouch in plain song. You made that possible. Oh, I got the Otaro, Pro Otaro Protector face paint. I'll make sure Kel's body is properly seen to Okay, Kel but why do you have exclamation points? Alright, I'm at the base. I'm checking on Gaia and Zoe. Because I haven't checked on them in a while. Oh, Aloy. Your Karja friend came through. Talana? She went to that Asaram camp you two were looking for, to the southwest. Aloy. Hi. Sorry, I didn't mean to startle you. You sure you're okay being alone in here? I have Gaia. And learning how to interpret the glyphs of the old ones, it keeps me occupied. Have you gone back to plain song at all? I thought about it, but I wouldn't know what to tell them. The chorus already thinks me a thorn in the thicket. If they knew what we did to Fa, even okay, if they but... understood, there'd be little they could grasp about all. Fair this. enough. Okay, that's no. true. For now, I must leave the tribe behind. Sounds like you met my friend Talana. Yes, the Karja Huntress. I haven't seen armor like hers since the Red Raids, but Varl tells me that she too suffered at the hands of the Mad Sun King. Yeah, she's one of the good ones. She is. Trust me. Okay. So you've been talking to Gaia? Yes. She was kind enough to take me through some of the history of the Old Ones, including their demise and the heroic actions of her creator, Elizabeth Sobek. I was surprised to see she was you. Past, but reborn? N not that I claim to understand how. You mentioned you've been teaching yourself how to read? Yes. Gaia was kind enough to put together a list of glyphs used by the Old Ones. She helped me decipher some of the data you've collected and showed me how to use the focus to help the process. It's not easy, but it's been working so far. Yeah. That's good to hear. Did Gaia tell you anything about Zenith? She did. Though it wasn't exactly easy to believe. Yeah, the whole spaceship there thing. There are places yeah. among the stars where life can bloom as it does here. Well, it is humbling, to say the least. I bet. And heartbreaking that such life should be bent on destroying ours. Yeah, it's dumb. Uh. So, how does a tribe like the Utaru manage to maintain the peace with warriors like the Tanakh? By holding them off. When our fields bloomed aplenty, the Tanakh looked upon our lands with envy. But Plainsong's dishes provided sanctuary and high ground to keep invaders at bay. In the end, even the Tanakh saw sense in a truce. Okay, that's the reasonable of them. to provide the Tanakh with food from our crops every year. In exchange, the Tanakh would relinquish one of their own, a veteran, to train the Utaru in combat. That seems These like a pretty fair deal. Abandoned a few years after the derangement. Oh. But some veterans still remain in the plains. Oh. I believe I've met them already. I've been meaning to ask, what's the deal with you and the chorus? You didn't seem to be on the best of terms. That's what happens when you're the one Utaro who insists on publicly defying them. Twice. When the Karja invaded the Utaru Plains, they did more than just attack our villages. They burned our fields, took our people as slaves, and murdered those who were too weak to make the trip back to Meridian. To be sacrificed in the Sunring. I was helping the healers. Mm. 
as waves of refugees swarmed into Plainsong. The chorus was divided in how to face the invaders. Some saw sense in raising arms. Others believed the dishes would keep us safe, as they had many times before. And while they bickered, I buried the seeds of the fallen. Hmm. That couldn't have been easy. Seeing your people suffer while the Karja invaded your lands. I come from a small village near Plainsong. My grandmother used to say there was no seed that wouldn't grow there. I moved to the dishes when I decided to apprentice as a healer. When the Red Raids began, I thought about going back. But the injured kept pouring into Plainsong. Day after day. So I kept putting it off. One day, I woke up to hear a Karja raiding party had ransacked my village during the night. Oh no. I rushed there with the healers to help the survivors, but... There weren't any left. That's really sad. The smell of burning flesh haunts me to this day. I'm sorry, oh. Zoe. I made it a point to appear before the chorus as soon as we returned. To demand that we take a stand against the invaders. I was denied. So I left to fight on my own. You said you set out to fight the Karja alone? I did. But it turned out I wasn't the only one. News of my disagreement with the chorus spread through the plains. Before I knew it, I had more than a dozen Utaru warriors ready to follow me into battle. That's awesome. We knew we couldn't take on the Karja armies head on. But we also knew the lay of the land better than they did. We ambushed smaller raiding parties, sabotaged their supply lines, and hit their encampments at night. Sounds like you were a force to be reckoned with. Mm hmm Enough that the Tanakh took notice. When the clans began to push the Karja back east, they let us join their ranks. We chased the enemy all the way to Baron Light. You said you were at Baron Light when the Tanakh defeated the Karja? Tanakh marshals climbed the cliffs of the Daunt under cover of night, hmm. then attacked from the other side. Before we knew it, the gates were open, and the full force of the clans burst through. What happened next was... not something I like to remember. When all the dust and blood settled, I smelled it again. The stench of burnt flesh. Oh. Our enemies defeated. What was left of my squad returned to the Utaru Plains. I went back to Plainsong. But even as the harvest passed, it didn't feel like I'd truly returned at all. Is that when you became a grave singer? I thought oh. soothing the suffering of others would somehow appease my own. Then you came along and gave me a choice. I could either sing at people's graves or fight for a chance to keep them alive. Yeah. I'm glad you chose the latter. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, that's it then. But if you need anything, you can contact me through your focus. I'll keep that in mind. Does she know how? Okay. Is there anything else that's new? Looks like this room's changed. Is that your doing, Gaia? Yes. I have repurposed the displays to track the cauldrons you have acquired data from. What displays? These displays? This? Over here? Cool, I can override a Sky Drifter and a Ravager. Nothing else? That one's for orange. Hmm. So I need sack webbing. A plow horn horn. Okay, I can I can do this. Whoa, don't want to go there. Ah, uh, this is where Guy is. Yeah. 
Hey -o. Welcome back. Thank you. What's this? Gaia? What is this? It is a control console for a drone based imaging system connected to this dome. Oh? I will transmit the relevant data to your focus. Thank you. So this Cyclops is a network of drones to monitor the deteriorating biosphere conditions. I guess it was meant to display on the dome, but the drones aren't connected anymore. I think I can reconnect some of them already. It seems like there are more out there. Okay. Let's do it. Okay. Uh. Data modules in. What am I doing? Whoa. Whoa. Oh, that's too cool. That's too cool. Okay. So I can choose which area I want. Okay, I don't have those ones. Anything to say about this? No? Well, if you'd only like that one, I'll keep that one at the end, but I do want to see what they all look like. Oh, you like the desert. Huh. And what's this one? Not much going on in this one, though. She liked the first one the best. Hey, Gaia. Me again. Welcome back, Aloy. Where shall we resume? Well, I haven't actually gotten any of the uh, subordinate functions. How long do we have then? At present rates, without additional factors. The biosphere will cross a point of no return in approximately four months. Right, okay. And if I gather Aether, Demeter, Poseidon, merge you with them? We will only gain a few months more. Okay. Well, every bit counts. Yep. How are things around here? Zoe has been studying the morphology of her land gods. In an effort to understand their sickness. Without the abilities of Hephaestus, I am unfortunately unable to correct their programming. I'm working on it. However, Zoe and I are hopeful we will find an alternative way to heal them. Really? Well, keep at it. Okay. Time to go. I'll be on my way. I wish you safe travels. Thanks. Oopsie. Come on. Get her. Come on. Give. Thank you. Whoa. Come on. Ugh. Get 
Yeah, knock that helmet off. All right, headshot him. Headshot him. Nice. Are you firing now? Well, I'm not. I am. Ah. Uh. Come on. Are you gonna are you gonna do anything? Fight, Fine, gotcha. whatever. Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> Bitch. No, she's over there. I aimed for her. Thank you. No, up. Oh, hey, like, oh my god. I hate edges. Pardon me. Coming through. Nice. All right, where's the rest of them? Here you are. Come on, get his head. That's way too high. What is that? Someone's fighting in the background. What is going on over there? There we go. There you are. Oh, are you not dead yet? There's someone else too? Oh, jeez. Get him! Strike from above! Strike from above! Strike- Ah, oh, fuck you. Yeah. 